Hi, myself, Sainat Katirupalli, a senior con faculty and a GRE expert at IMS International. Today's video is going to be on a trickier problem solving question from the topic quadratic equation. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to really work these kind of trickier quad quadratic equation questions smartly and just within five to six steps, okay? So before you go ahead watching the answer explanation to this question, I would certainly recommend you to take a pause of this video for two minutes, try work this question on your own, and then resume back watching this video. Certainly this way it's going to add value to your learning. Now, coming to this question, here we're given that if there are two real number solutions to this quadratic equation, which are represented as P and Q, what is mod P minus Q? So over here, we have a quadratic equation, X square minus seven X plus four equal to two, that we can write it as four minus two, which is plus two equal to zero. And to this quadratic equation, we have the roots as P and Q, which means P plus Q, is going to be sum of roots and PQ is product of roots, right? Now, the given quadratic equation, we're going to compare it with X square minus X times of P plus Q plus PQ equal to zero, which is a quadratic equation in terms of sum of roots and product of roots. So relatively comparing this quadratic equation with this, we have P plus Q equal to seven and PQ equal to two, right? So this reminds us of one formula when A plus B given and you have the value of AB, then A minus B whole square is nothing but a plus B whole square minus four times of AB. So using this concept here, we can write P plus Q whole square minus four times of PQ as P minus Q whole square, right? So we have P plus Q as seven, plug it over here. This is seven square. We have PQ as two. So plug it over here in place of PQ. We have four times of two. So this becomes 49 minus eight, which is 41. And you all know one thing that this is P minus Q whole square. But the concept that you need to be applying here, see, before I teach you the concept, you need to understand that the question over here is not asking you P minus Q, but mod of P minus Q. What we obtained over here is P minus Q whole square equal to 41. Understand that? root of x square is mod x. Therefore, squaring on both sides, you have this mod mi minus q equal to root 41. Hence, the answer to this question is E. So good luck and happy GRE preparation.